Hi, I'm Karen. Welcome to my channel. This is where I share my experiences using cruelty-free skincare and makeup on mature skin. It's time for an empties video. Here's my empties bin. Let's get started. This pretty blue bottle used to have a label that said Dr. Teal's Body Wash. My husband likes to repurpose containers, which is awesome, but I left this on the bathroom counter to dry out before I put it in my empties bin, and I didn't tell him what I was doing, so he snatched it up and soaked off the label so that he could reuse the bottle. So pretend this has a label that says Dr. Till's Body Wash. This was the pink Himalayan salt formula, which we enjoyed. It had a nice scent, but I do prefer the eucalyptus and spearmint. I think that one is so refreshing. So next time I buy this, I'll probably buy the eucalyptus and spearmint, but I will repurchase this. I like Dr. Till's products. This big bottle is $5 at Walmart. It has nice ingredients. It's a good brand, cruelty-free, of course. So definitely repurchase this, maybe in a different scent, but I will rebuy it. This is a box from my e-salon hair color. I didn't save all the little containers. I just saved the box so I could talk about it. I've been using e-salon for my hair color over a year now, and I just love the company. They make a beautiful formula. They get this to me quickly and efficiently. I love their customer service. When you first sign up for e-salon, you fill out a questionnaire, you can attach a picture, you tell them if you wanna keep that hair color or change the hair color. I did that and then I got an email back from my consultant, my color consultant, asking a few more questions about what I wanted to do with my hair color. Then they sent me the formula and they had it spot on, exactly what I wanted. I have a formula that's light brown, with copper and then some mahogany in it. And it's the perfect shade for me. I just love it. It's a gorgeous hair color formula. It doesn't damage my hair at all. It leaves my hair silky soft and smooth. It's exactly the color I want. When it's time to recolor, it's because my gray roots have grown out, not because my color has faded. It lasts. And I just can't say enough about their customer service. Every month when it's time, or every six weeks when it's time to send me a new box, they'll send an email asking if I want to change anything in the color. I can change the frequency of how often I get the box instantaneously. I've done that several times. I've never changed the color because I got it right the very first time, but I have changed how often I get it a few times, and it's so easy and quick to do. It comes in the mail. It's easy to use. The instructions are easy to follow. Everything you need is in here. Your mixes, of course, and then gloves, a stain guard for your face, a wipey for any drips. Um, the first time I ordered it, I also got a cape and a little brush and a mixing bowl. I still have those with some clips from holding my hair back as I section it. They make it so easy to color your hair at home. I've colored my hair at home for like 20 years and I used drugstore box formulas this is so much nicer and it's cruelty free. I really had a hard time. That was one of the things when I went cruelty free, it was one of the hardest things to find was a cruelty free hair color. But e-salon is, is one that I am so glad I found and I highly recommend them if you're looking for an at home hair color. This is an empty wrapper from my Dude Wipes. I think that flushable wipes are one of the greatest inventions of the last 20 years. I <laughs> just, I love using the flushable wipes. These I especially love. These were created by four guys that were really good friends in their apartment in Chicago. It's an American based brand, a small company. If you go to their website, the guys are hilarious. There's lots of middle school potty jokes that I find really funny. I raised two sons, so I can appreciate that kind of humor. Plant-based fibers are used to, to make these wipes, so they're completely biodegradable. They decompose as quickly as toilet paper, so they're not bad for the environment. 
They are made with no dyes and I just really like supporting this brand. It's a small brand. It's a beautiful product. They did a great job on it. They're funny. Uh, you can tell they're having a great time with this company. They were on Shark Tank. If you want to go look that up on YouTube, it's a really funny episode. Highly recommend these if you like using flushable wipes. This is Jordan Samuel, the Matinee Gel Cleanser. I use all three of Jordan's cleansers. This is my favorite morning cleanse. This one has some salicylic acid, so it helps to clear out those enlarged pores that I have that are very easily clogged around my nose. And it also has aloe leaf juice, which is very cooling and soothing on the skin and it hydrates and calms my skin. It's got chamomile, it's got cucumber extract. It's just a beautiful formula that's very soothing on the skin. The gel just glides across my face. I love the feel of it. It leaves my face soft and hydrated and clean. Love, love, love this cleanser. Like all of Jordan's products, it's just beautifully formulated. Definitely have repurchased this multiple times and I'll keep on using it as long as Jordan makes it. This is the Verb Ghost Conditioner. I use the Verb Ghost Shampoo, the conditioner, and the Verb Ghost Oil. I alternate these with my Olaplex products and I just love that routine for my hair. If you've seen any of my empties, you've seen this before. This is the Trader Joe's Coconut Body Butter. Still love it as much as I always did. This is my go-to everyday body lotion. It goes on silky smooth. It glides right on my skin. It mixes well with any body oils I put with it. It has great ingredients. I love the scent. $5 for this big tub. If you have a Trader Joe's near you, I highly recommend trying this body butter. It's a wonderful formula. It's a great deal. Definitely repurchase this. I have one that I'm using right now and I already have the backup ready to go. This is the Timeless Vitamin C Serum. I've been using this almost a year now and I love this vitamin C serum. It has L-ascorbic acid, vitamin E, ferulic acid. It's a gorgeous formula. It goes on almost like a lotion. It's not watery or sticky like some of the vitamin C serums I've used. It goes on really smooth. It sinks into my skin. It has 20% L-ascorbic acid, so it's a potent formula, but it doesn't feel at all stinging on my skin. I can see that it's working though. My skin is more even, my texture is better. It's a great product, it's $25 for this bottle, and it lasts me about a month and a half, and I use it very generously. I don't just use it on my face, I use it down my neck, on my chest, on the backs of my hands. So I do use it generously, and it still lasts me a good long time. I keep it in the refrigerator because l acid does break down easily, but this one is in an airtight container that doesn't let any light in to damage the formula. So this one will last you longer than a lot of vitamin C serums will. Okay, the last thing in my empties bin is this. This is the Speak Cream Deodorant. I got this in a Petty Four box and I did use it all up. I didn't know what I thought about it at first. It was a kind of a hard packed cream that I had trouble getting out. I didn't like that, but then I figured out if I warmed up this tin, if I just ran some warm water across it, the cream got really soft and was a lot easier to apply. It went on really smoothly after that. The scent kind of got me at first. It smells like Thanksgiving dinner, but I got used to that fresh herbally scent after a while and didn't mind it at all. It worked really well for me. It was very effective. It kept me smelling good. It kept me dry. This little tin lasted me a good long time. This is a great brand. Speak makes beautiful products and I was really happy to give this one a try and glad I used it. If you do decide to give it a try, make sure you do warm the tin up though so that it gets nice and soft and creamy for you. That's it. That's everything I have in my empties for the month of May. 
I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please consider subscribing. Just hit that subscribe button down below and then the notification bell next to that so you'll know when I post new videos. Bye for now.